sisters how y'all doing happy holidays welcome back to my channel welcome back into the community welcome all and any new spirit boosters welcome back visitors and thanks for all the ones that have subscribed like the video and share your going zones and what's happening carrying ohms and all i appreciate it well everything is winding down have you all finished your christmas shopping you got your dinner list all taken care of you bought all you need for your dinner well i told you guys what we're having barbecue I don't know about the um, side dishes. I know with barbecue, I'll have um, for sure some potato salad. And uh, my dessert, I told y'all I'm making that uh, cobbler. And now remind me, what y'all staring at? See that ready whip non dairy item there? It's made with almond milk. I would prefer, I probably could have found it in probably, um, I would have preferred it to be with coconut. But, um, maybe i think if y'all know whole foods maybe they might have carried it in there hopefully it doesn't be any recalls on these products that i purchased oh oh even though that was the thing there was the thing with the onions and all that and carrying on hope you guys still continue to wash your produce because yes that's allegedly filthy you don't want to have that um being used without you know washing it down but yep i got that non-dairy with uh topping for my uh apple cobbler that i'm gonna make i thought i was gonna do it today and i might later on i'm not sure depending on how i'm feeling because um um my stomach a little queasy I think, I don't know, do I have some dairy or something? I have to watch how much dairy that I take, intake in my in this body of mine. That's the reason why I got the non-dairy ready whip and non-dairy milk and stuff because I'm cool. I'm all right if I don't eat a lot of real dairy products. But that cheese, Lord Jesus, I am struggling not to do that. But I know when I do overdo it, I will have gas spasms up the kahula and if anybody deals with spasms after eating gassy foods and stuff whatever food that causes you to have a tremendous amount of gas inside of your stomach intestinal area please share in the comments i would like to know what you do about that because gas oh my god it's it's horrible i know this 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 uh <laughs> conversation is going where <laughs> i thought we were holiday talking we having a holiday conversation well we are this is going to um have something to do with the holidays and uh you know especially depending on what kind of desserts you make and if it involves milk a lot of people might not say that they you know have a little problem with gas <laughs> and uh hey if they do have products that don't that's why i put that dream of up there too to let y'all know now uh for sure and then you know i did also have the um cool whip and that's uh you know this stuff is not non-dairy stuff but I, I am going to um i didn't even know they had a non-dairy cool whip because you know i was telling my husband i think i would like some cool whip you know some ready whip to put on my pie and then i got to look it online and that's when i found out because i didn't know they had a non-dairy ready whip and i'm glad that i do know now hey but now still you got to watch out for the sugar and, and you know, now I can't have too much sugar. And I did pick up some oranges too because I'm going to spice up my little uh, apples with a little orange juice. I'm going to cook my little apples first because what I'm going to do is I want everything to be, you know, done. Like when I make my um, pie pies, all my fillings are already done and basically i'm just waiting on the crust to get done now mind you i used to didn't like uh my crust to be gummy and stuff like that but now i like the 
semi gummy crust with my pie a lot of people don't like that they want their crust to be hard but i like when i'm put that bottom i'm gonna put a bottom crust in my little uh uh apple uh cobbler pie that i'm gonna prepare because i want some crust that's the whole thing i like crust and if it and uh i'm gonna cook it and uh i'm not gonna bake the crust a little bit first because I'm just going to let it, you know, take its time and cook that crust. And um, and I like a little little um, moist crust. You know, it's cooked, but it's gum. Got a little gum, too. And I like that on my crust, on my on my uh, fruit, fruit filling. So, if y'all like that, let me know in the comments. Uh, share what how you like your um, pie crust to be completely done or you want it slightly done or you know done but gum <laughs> dumb dumb done but on the you know i guess you say the pliable side it's done but it just got it's not uh it's firm it's gummy i just gotta say what it is it's just gummy but it's delicious that way i'll put a little butter on it and stuff so i want that crust tasting good I'm going to flavor my crust. That's like I flavored my pie crust for those Popeyes. I'm definitely going to do that. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to do that. And I'm going to cook my apples first. Like I said, I'm going to make sure my filling is done. And all I'm doing is waiting on the crust to get done. So I can't wait to try this non-dairy ready with topping and see how that like that. And if I do, that's what I'll be using in the future. And hopefully, whenever I get to Whole Foods... I'll go with my daughter. She like to go around a whole bunch of different stuff. She did. She is shop. Well, I don't know what to call it. She just like to go to uh, different places and shop and stuff. She, she gets. She moves around a lot to different stores. She likes shopping. She loves shopping. I gotta say it like that. And uh, I gotta say, oh, to uh, hey, hey, uh, hey, daughter, and uh. Um, Ron, I heard that you wanted to give me a phone so I can get a cash app. And if you watch this video, I hope that you um, um, are still thinking about getting me a phone. And go ahead on and get me a phone in. I appreciate that. And I give me a cash app because um, I guess I don't know. I have to figure out how to do all these things, but. I will appreciate it. If that's what you, your intentions are and you serious, go ahead on. Thank you very much. I heard. <laughs> okay. My light has gone out here. Hold on, y'all. Let's get this light fixed. I don't know if I can fix it, but it's kind of dark. There you go. It decided to come back. This thing is killing me, but I'm going to try to find me a light that go up in that uh hood over this stove i need to do some work on this hood over this stove because i need to get a look this light went on and off but anyway i hope you guys are having a happy holiday i know i just got distracted and started talking i'm just carrying on in the video about stuff i should just be quiet about <laughs> but anyway i hope you all are having a tremendous beautiful day and following on up into the Christmas day, Christmas Eve, Christmas day. Oh, y'all see my car bell up there? That's my little champagne. Oh, what is it? California champagne sweet rose. I have never had this before in my life, but that's the champagne I'm gonna put on ice for the new year. <laughs> And say happy new year happy new year if i don't hear if i'm not back but knowing me in my uh video hauling butt self making self i'll probably be on here who knows but uh the crust stay is what i decided to use i think for the pie crust and then back there my husband he got him he did a little shopping haul he got him those little mini muffin cakes and got some more of the Pillsbury Crescent Rolls, and then I got some trappy hot sauce back there, and he finally got the sweet onions. See, they're whole different color from brown onions. They on the light golden side, 
I love these sweet onions and yes they are sweet and I love them in dishes I don't know what we eating today probably whatever you find and that's what you eat today but yeah so this is just a little mini haul for it's, it is a holiday haul too because I got my little champagne I got my little rolls that's probably gonna be cooked for the holiday I got my pie crust oranges for the pie yes indeed we ready we ready i didn't have to go out my way and buy any extra stuff for the holidays because we got the meat we got barbecue sauce we got the charcoal we are prepared and ready we are in survival mode <laughs> well anyway i hope you guys are all being safe and keeping being mindful of your surroundings when you're out shopping i know some of y'all gonna be out there in that last minute crowd trying to get what you need to cook something or the last minute gift just be safe and share your goings on and your what's happening and carrying on i know some of y'all carrying on i know y'all carrying on about something y'all want to share or just say hello <laughs> it's good it's good and for some of you passy buys if today is the day you decide you want to be a spirit booster thank you very much and if you're too shy to share your care zone, going zones, and what's happening, just simply say hello <laughs> to all of us, your hosts, and the rest of these spare boosters on the, in this community. We love to hear from you. And happy holidays, everyone, that do celebrate the holidays, because I know a lot of us don't celebrate holidays. But I know people that don't celebrate holidays, but they will eat you know like they do on a holiday but they'll eat some like it's holidayish <laughs> but anyway if y'all make anything with crust remember to let me know and uh come on go off this this my timer y'all tripping but uh i'm gonna get out here and let y'all finish y'all holiday decorating cooking because i know I bet some of y'all made some cookies and stuff. I supposed to be making those sugar cookies, but I can't make too many sweets. Like, I supposed to have made those blueberry muffins, but definitely I'm making this crust. Okay, okay. I'm going to try and do that because I know I told y'all I was going to eat that during the, um, this week. But let me get out of here. Tips. I got like tips. Just stay happy, merry, and prepared stay in survival mode that's the best tip of all stay in survival mode y'all know what's going on in the world right now i told y'all i got my booster shot and uh that's working for me but if y'all want to share like i say just leave it in the comment section and don't forget to read in the uh, description box where stuff that i didn't mention i forgot to mention because my amnesia that kicked in. <laughs> Read the um, description box, y'all. And uh, that's going to be it. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. Happy New Year. Have a great meal. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video.